The Class 5A, a region championship on the line tonight at Carolina Forest. Panthers entertaining 10th ranked Sumter. This game always a battle tonight, no different. We off to the Forest. Here come the Panthers looking for that all important win over the Gamecocks. First possession, Panthers in Sumter territory. Ethan Hamilton fakes the handoff, finds the seam, and gains a huge chunk yardage to the red zone. Mark Morris calling the shots, says, hey, let's get in the end zone. Third and goal to go, Hamilton hands off to Khalil Johnson, who follows the big fellas in for six. Carolina Forest takes the early lead with 10 minutes to go on the clock. Seven, nothing. Panthers, Sumter back to pass. Nice pitch and catch for the Gamecocks. That would find them in the red zone. Sumter. They missed the field goal because the Panther D came up big. That would be huge later on in the game. Carolina Forest on fourth and long. They go for the field goal. The kick is up and true from 40 yards out. Panthers took a 10-0 lead. Sumter would come back to lead 14-10, only to watch Khalil Johnson score the game touchdown with 20 seconds to go as the Panthers win it tonight. 17-14 to take a 2-0 lead in the region. They are in the driver's seat for the region championship for the first time in several years because Sumter has been the one team they just couldn't quite get over the hump. Tonight, they do. Congratulations to Mark Morris, his staff, and the Panthers as they go to 2-0 with a uh, Sockesty coming to town next week or driving up to the beach or to the forest next week to take on the Panthers. I'm pretty excited here, as you can see, man. I'm just excited for Mark Morris, and I just know the struggles they've had against Sumter. As for Sumter, they go home, and they prepare themselves for St. James. We'll see how next week plays out. And that